so we just dropped off my super awesome cousin Lydia at uh, the foot doctor, or her doctor for her feet, because she's a ballerina. And so with all the different ballet stuff that she's doing, she's always having problems with her feet. And she's only in town for like, she was in town for Christmas and then she's leaving on Saturday. Uh, so this was my chance to see her. But uh, now my mom and I are gonna go shopping around in the U Village, which is exciting. Uh, it's a bunch of little shops that are close to the UW. So that should be cool. So I'm on my 10 and uh, I've got two hours left of work and I'm so tired. I'm so hungry but they don't give me a 30 uh, which means I don't have time to get food. So by the time I got it I have to be working again and it would just get cold. But um, I'm babysitting after this, and Dylan and Kate usually eat dinner around this time, so that means they're gonna feed me dinner, which is always good, because sometimes they like, <coughs> take me to Kid Valley and Red Robin and stuff, which is nice of them. Oh man, that's such a, it's such a fun job. They always treat me nicely, and they brought me to Hawaii with them once too, which is cool, twice. Yeah, they've done that twice. Um, I mean, like, for the most part, it was just like, oh, take the kids to the pool, and we'll relax here. But I mean, aside from a couple of times when they did that, they were always, the parents were always there, too. So it wasn't like they really needed me or anything. I don't know. Well, um, it was fun. And, uh, oh, I'm so tired. I didn't realize I was, <laughs> uh, mom woke me up at nine this morning to take my cousin Lydia to the doctor, but we were taking her to the doctor at 10.30. So she said, okay, well you can either set an alarm for 9.30 or you could just get up now. Set my alarm for 9.30, went back to sleep, and that jolted me awake again. I just haven't recovered all day. <laughs> But shopping was fun. Uh, after we dropped off Lydia at the doctor, we, Mom and I, went shopping in the U District, and I got some new pairs of pants, which is cool. I'm slowly upgrading my wardrobe. I want to start dressing a little respectably, uh, <laughs> because I'm tired of people being like, "Oh, what year are you?" And it's like, "Oh, I'm," a, you know, like, "Oh, I'm a junior." They're, no, how does that go? Usually, it's like, "Oh." What year are you? Are you like a freshman? Maybe a sophomore? And I'm like, I'm a junior. I'm like, oh, you know, it's this big deal. And I realized part of it's just because I don't look 20. But part of the reason why I don't look 20 could be because of the way I'm dressing. You know? Maybe if I started looking more like an adult, then people would think I'm an adult. I don't know. But also, I just want... I feel nice when I'm dressed up a bit. So I think that would be that would be good. I've got my my uh, teenage boy look going uh, so far. Normally I just wear jeans and then a band t-shirt. But I'm thinking about maybe those jeans could be like uh, I don't know. Could be a skirt. I don't do very well in skirts because it's always so cold always cold it seems like anyways um yeah I think that's it for now and then I'm babysitting after this but I think I already said that I'm really tired I'm really hungry <sighs> okay bye I'm home now and this is our huge it's really scary it normally doesn't do this I don't know what's wrong with this the other one doesn't work I'm just like oh hi Yoshi hi yeah, the other one over there doesn't work. So we're stuck with this. <sighs> so that's it for my day. Um, I just found out I'm going to Nam in California at the end of this month. 
uh, which should be pretty exciting. We're going there with my brother and my dad. Um, I'm a little worried because I have major anxiety issues with airplanes. Um, had a had a bit of a panic attack the last time I was on an airplane, but you know what? I think I think I'll be okay. Yeah. That'll be, that'll be interesting. Um, yeah. Anyways, I am babysitting tomorrow. Yeah, uh, but it's my day off from work at the theater, so that'll be, that'll be cool. And I'm probably gonna go see Life Pie again. I saw it while I was at school with one of my friends, um, at the theater downtown that I'm probably transferring to now, which is cool. Uh, they still haven't gotten back to me about whether I'm, like, for sure transferring or not, though, so that's kind of weird. Um, but aside from that, um, yeah, I'm going to see it again, but this time I'm going to see it in 3D, which should be cool, because I like, I like movies in 3D. Even though they've got the big glasses and people get dizzy or whatever, I, I love uh, especially IMAX 3D, but we're not seeing an IMAX 3D because the theater we're going to, uh, doesn't have IMAX. Because the cool thing is that, um, where I work, I can go to any of the theaters that have the same name and see movies for free with my family, uh, and a friend. <laughs> I can only bring one friend at a time, but it's still cool. So I get to see movies that my theater doesn't get, uh, if the other theater gets them, or the one that I'm transferring to gets them. But that one's all the way downtown, so we don't go there very often. Um, I've only probably seen a movie there, like, three times? Twice? I don't know. But I will probably see many movies there in the future if I transfer there. It should be cool. Um, also kind of worried about transferring there just because it's downtown and theater shifts usually run pretty late so there's a high probability I'll be walking home alone at in night um, I mean I'll take the bus but walking to and from the bus and all that I don't know I guess I'll figure it out but that's it for now. Good night.